Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new episode of Niche. My name is Eros and oh my goodness, guys, I may have went a little bit overboard on the breeding processes and I've been playing a little bit off camera and I have a ton of creatures. I, I've been having so much fun just breeding, but I think it's time that we prepare to leave this island and we are going to go on a brand new adventure to a new island somewhere else and... This way looks scary because there's bones everywhere, so I think we're gonna go this way. This way looks like it's a good place. And I think how it works is you can take nine creatures with you. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And when you're standing here uh, and you click this right here, you will be teleported to a brand new island. And I'm a little bit nervous for that, but hopefully our family is able to do it. We just have so many people. I'm just so overwhelmed right now. <laughs> and I have learned a lot. I think I've made a lot of mistakes with the immunity, but I am learning. This is a learning process. Um, so we're going to go and try to gather up as much food as possible. And then hopefully by the end of this episode, we will at least have a better idea of who we want to take to the new island with us. And I'm thinking we're going to take, uh, I guess like teenagers, uh, C and A... Looking at the immunities, D and A, a lot of A, 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 <laughs> a lot of A, um, but oh my goodness, a lot of our creatures have died before. Here we have um, Cirami right here, um, and we have Tara Van Van, and we have a bunny in a nest, like, we just, we just have a bunny. <laughs> we have a bunny in a nest, what is this? This is amazing. Okay, hold on, I need to take a picture of that because that is just so cute. There's just, you know, a bunny hanging out in the nest. Hold on. <laughs> Trying to get a good center. Here we go. Bunny in the nest. Bunny in the nest. We have a bunny in the nest. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. But uh, so many creatures, so many creatures. We need, we need to move. It's time to move on. It's time to move. And yeah, I don't know if we have the best genetics going on right now. Um, here's Isco and Timmy. Oh my gosh, my dog in real life is here, if you can hear him. Um, but Isco, I think this is her last turn. Um, so this is her last baby that she had. Our fierce warrior princess. Our first strength eight character. Um, and I think this is her legacy. <laughs> her last baby is Caravan, um, a little boy. Not as strong as his mom, but she did have tons of other, like, strong, um, creatures so hopefully we can choose some of them to come with us here's um seven um she's pregnant right now oh my gosh there's just so many characters there's so many things um all right so who do we want to come over i think we're going to uh you're you're not as healthy and i think your mom was here but she's no longer here with us i think she passed away unfortunately um all right so let's see um d and a you have sickly genes. Oh my goodness. I don't know what to do. I don't know. I kind of want to take Cirami with us. I don't know if she'll be um, too old when we get to the new place, but here's the new place over here. So if we take her with us, um, and I think you can bring pregnant um, characters. So if we move her over here and have her get pregnant and then start moving her down this way, um, it should be okay. And then we'll start bringing over the younger uh, characters, I think. I think that's what we'll do. I'm not sure if that's the best strategy, but we're going to roll with it. So any teenagers or babies, we're going to start heading over to this way. Or we're just going to see what happens. And if we go extinct, we can always start a new island, which we definitely would do if we did go extinct. Because I'm having a lot of fun with this game. I'm just, you know, I'm learning. I'm a little bit of a noob. Um, but yeah, we're gonna, I think, skip the turn after we go, I think we got all the berries that we can. All right, I just have like characters over here, but just because I got so overwhelmed with just the amount of creatures here on the island. So we are going to skip the turn and <laughs> there's a the bunny. <laughs> Let's get the bunny. There we go. We got the bunny and we're going to move Sirami over here. She's going to be our leader. And we're gonna move here over here and hopefully we'll be able to move before she becomes an elder so she can give birth to this baby. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if we'll have enough time. That might have been a mistake. Um, and then we have this one over here. She has D and F, so we're going to bring her over to and start bringing her this way. We're going to gather up these berries over here and let us go over here. And we cannot gather berries with him, but if we come over here, 
cannot gather berries with her either. What if we bring this one? There we go. We can gather berries with her. Um, or should I say him, rather? Van Roo. So he has F and A. Alright, so let me take a look at all the genetics and kind of decide who I want to bring over to the new island with us. It's going to take a while because I'm going to go through everybody's um, immunities and kind of like decide what we want to do. But, <laughs> oh my goodness. But we need to go. I think, I think we've outgrown our humble island home and it's time to move our creatures on. And it's time to move on, guys. It's time to move on. And here is our first yellow-eyed baby. Um, no longer a baby, um, but it was born off camera. And this character actually has yellow eyes, which I thought was really interesting. Um, but yeah, and we have our blue-eyed boys over here. Oh my goodness, I love our blue-eyed children. I love them so much. But yes, so I'm going to decide who we want to bring to the new island. Alright, so I think I have a collection of creatures that I want to take with us to a brand new island. So we have another blue-eyed prince with us. We have some collectors with us. We have some strong people. You, um, Caravan, has four collecting, which is the highest that we've ever gotten before. And let's see, three, two, one, seven, and we're going to bring you two with us. Um, if you can make it over here. There we go. And... Poor Cerami. I don't think we're going to be able to take her with us. I mean, we can, but she's going to die in the next turn, which I'm so sad about. So I don't think we can take her with us. I don't think we can. So we're going to have to find a replacement for her. Um, kind of short notice. Uh, maybe we'll bring you. Can you make it? I think you can make it. Okay, I'm so sorry, Cerami. Cerami, you're not going to be able to come with us. I'm sorry. I tried. Oh no, she's not going to be able to come with us either. <laughs> oh no, she's going to die. Alright, why don't we have you come in this nest and maybe you'll have your baby, but probably not. You probably won't be able to. Um, and let's go and ca gather up some of the food that we have over here. Oh my goodness, there's just so much, so much things going on. We definitely need to change, and I think the next island is supposed to be harder. So hopefully we won't go extinct. But if we do, we can always start over. Um, and learn from our mistakes that we that we have made. <laughs> We've made some mistakes. Some mistakes have been made. Uh, but let's go and continue collecting more food. Oh, well, you guys are going to have a baby, but we won't see what it is because we're leaving. We're leaving the island. The island is getting too full. Look at all the, the creatures that I have over here. Um, I like to think that these guys are... Um, See, not these guys, but these guys over here are getting ready to maybe, like, gather up and maybe they will go to the stronger island. Because it's really sad because all these, like, creatures are part of the same family and they are leaving um, a bunch of them behind, which is sad. But, you know what? It's for the greater good. We must go and see what we can find off into a brand new area. All animals on the port fields migrate to another island. Animals outside the port leave the tribe and become wild. Okay. Oh, alright. I don't know if we made the best choices, but we're gonna go anyways. And we're gonna do this. We're gonna bring our family and our genes with us. We have a bunch of pregnant females, so there'll be some new births on the island, hopefully. If we can find some nests and, you know, we're gonna go, I guess? It's gonna be fine. Is it? We're just gonna go. I don't know if we made the best choices, but I think it's time to leave. So we're gonna go and travel all animals on the port fields and migrate to another island. All right, we already read that. All right, so let's go and travel to a brand new island. Okay, so we have arrived to our brand new island. Look at this, oh my goodness. Look how much bigger this island is. And there's like four, five trees. There's five trees over there. There's different ways to leave. So there's this way, and it looks like there's also this way, which I'm not sure if this will take you back to where we came, maybe? Uh, perhaps? I see the, uh, interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. Apparently, we can move over here. I don't really know what that means. I don't want to know. Um, but was that because we were clicked on a creature that was over there, like in the old island? I don't really know what, why that did that. Um, but look at this place. Alright, so I see a nest right away, which is good. Um, it's definitely something that we'll need. And I see, let's see, we're on top of a little berry bush. So why don't we collect this? There we go. And, oh, it looks like you're on top of a nest too. So we have two nests right here. Okay. So very interesting. Very, very interesting. So we definitely want to have our females hop in a nest as soon as possible. So we'll have you hop in this nest 
And then we will have... Oh, there's three Nas! Wow! Okay, well, happy birthday. We're gonna have some babies in the next turns, and you can pop in this nest. Wow, all of our females that we brought over are pregnant and have their very own nest now, so I guess it's a good thing that we left. Um, so why don't we have the boys start exploring this area over here because we don't want anything to pop out and like surprise us and be like surprise um <laughs> and then i'm excited to see what babies that we have um coming in the next turn here we go all right anything else we can do um we're gonna have see i kind of want to like explore this way well, why don't we have you come up oh there's an interesting thing over here not sure that is. I think that actually hurts you if you try to harvest it. So we're not gonna- Oh, another berry bush! Yay! Another berries! More berries! Doo -ba -doo. And you are our big berry collector, so why don't we have you come over here? And why don't we change your gems back to green so we know that you are um, a really good collector. So, Caravan, you are a collector right now. And all right, I think we did pretty much all that we can do and we are going to skip our turn and let's see the brand new babies that we have in this brand new generation. Oh my goodness. So we have a Dalmatian, we have a little, um, <laughs> a little brown spotted one and a little tan one. Um, and we have, let's see, one boy and two girls it looks like. So let's go in, get in a closer look. So we have Ro Van Van who has speed 3, collecting 2, and strength 5, and he has G and A immunity. Alright, very interesting. And then let's take a look at here. We have Anna S. She has C and C. No, that's not too good. Not too good at all. Um, and she has speed 4, collecting 1, and strength 5. So I think she'll be a pretty good scout because she has pretty good speed. And then over here, we have... Sir Asi. Sir Asi has strength six, collecting one, and speed three. So she's gonna be another one of our little warriors that we have. Alright, so let's go have you collect these berries over here because you are the best at collecting berries. Um, and you can collect this berry. And I've been told by many of you to make sure that we don't leave our babies unattended. Um, so we're gonna have the mothers make sure that they stay on their nests. And maybe we'll have the boys kind of go out and explore a little bit. I kind of want to have you hang out by this bush. Why don't we have you come out here and you can start exploring maybe up this way. So why don't we have you pop over there and then we can have you. You're kind of slow but you're pretty strong so we're gonna have you go this way too. Kind of like follow them. Follow the leader. Do 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 do. And then we're gonna have you. I don't wanna go you, have you guys go too far because I do wanna breed you guys in the next turn. Um, alright, so. Hmm. Maybe we'll have. We want you here for now. So I guess we'll have you go out there and we'll have these um, males that are left behind breed with the females that are left and we'll have you kinda like scout around for now and see what we can find. Alright, so let's go ahead and skip the turn and. There we go. Oh, and it's raining too. Awesome. Oh no, you're sick! Oh no! Poor little baby! Oh, yeah, she is. She has double C immunity, so she, yeah, she is sick, so I don't know if she'll make it, unfortunately. Oh no, this is really sad. Alright, why don't we have you collect the berries? Um, and then we have this little bush over here that you can collect. There we go. Alright, so the babies are big enough to leave the nest, but I don't think it's a good idea to have them actually leave the nest yet. But we'll have to see. And now we can kind of start thinking about who we want to pair people with. So we have Ismi, who has D and C. And you have F and A. So you guys would be a good pair for the immunity purposes. <laughs> um, and then we have Anisme. And she has D and F. And you have F and G. And you have D and F as well. So probably not the best thing. Um, let's see. And what about you? You have C and F. So D and F. All right, we will have Carvan stay back right now with the females, and we'll also have Van Rose stay back with the females, and then we'll have the other males kind of explore a little bit of the island to see what we can find. I'm a little bit scared, uh, not gonna lie, but hopefully everything will be a-okay. Um, all right, and then we're gonna have you come over here, and you can 
I uh, don't think it's a good idea to collect that actually. All right, so why don't we have you kind of like explore this way and we're gonna have our females and these two males kind of stay over here. This can be like our little tiny like nursery area where we have these boys kind of like explore and see what they can find. So why don't we unlock that and you can also come over this way. There we go. All right, so let's go and skip our turn. I'm so nervous something's gonna like pop out and like eat everyone. Oh no, you're sick. That's so sad. Oh no, I don't want you to be sick, little one. I don't want you to be sick. Don't be sick. Um, all right, so I think we should still keep them in the nest together. I think that's what we should do. Um, like the babies. I don't think we should have the babies leave the nest. For some reason, you guys kept telling me, don't, Eros, don't let the babies leave the nest. So. All right, so we have, ooh, what's this? An interesting plant. Very interesting plant over here. So why don't we have you kind of like explore this way. And you can come over. Oh, another berry bush. Awesome. Berries. Berries for days. And we'll have you kind of like look over here and see what else we can find. And a very interesting plant over there. Hopefully it doesn't like try to eat us or anything. Um, we can explore that. And then we'll have you kind of go up this way. Alright, there we go. Look at this very mysterious a plant that we have here <laughs> but all right guys so many new things happening we have this mysterious plant we have a new generation of children um we have this huge big island to explore and i'm excited to see what we can find and i wonder if we can actually get off to like this little island over here i mean i guess we could because it's connected but i thought i saw like some that weren't connected like can we go over here like this one spot i don't know uh be curious to see what we can actually do or like over here could we have like one of the creatures like kind of just hang out right here i don't know and like these little islands but yeah so i hope you guys are enjoying this series and i'll see you guys in the next episode of niche i'm having so much fun playing this game and look at all the different like biomes that are here too there's blue and like browns and and yellows and all these trees so i'm so excited to explore this island and see what type of adventures we can have here